Hey YouTube, happy Saturday, back in the garage. I haven't been in the garage since Wednesday. Just haven't had the energy. Just starting to get back to feel like coming back in. So I think I showed you guys what I've been un... un they're digging out. So I think today I'm going to start scrapping some of these weed eaters and scrap some of this stuff. Um, I think I'm going to do an online yard sale and see if I can get some stuff, sell some stuff through Marketplace. Yeah, it's quite a task sometimes. It's just overwhelming a little bit especially sort and stuff so I'm hoping as I go forward I would be keeping stuff keeping things up I gotta go through this and pull off if there's any little brass nubbins on the end of it that one doesn't have one but like I said before I can get copper bearing price I, I just gotta find out what that price is and uh Take those into my yard just like that. Uh, maybe clean some of these things off and see see if that's brass or not. Um, gonna go through my brass bucket and get that sorted away. <clears throat> Slowly but surely. Now that we're into spring, I see a lot of you guys cleaning up your yards and around your places. Spring and summer is like hunting season for scrappers. Oh, I can't wait for large garbage day. Then I got a lot of these I got to take apart, but I've just been throwing in that box there. I got to sort that box because that box is like massively full of plugs. I'm going to do a, a video on tearing this puppy apart. See what's all in amongst this. See what's in one of these. I got the one here and I got another one there. And I think I got two or three more over there to take apart. So it'd be kind of neat to see what's in those. Still find lots of tools here and there as I'm going. It's like Christmas time every day I move with the tote. It's like, ooh, something new. Some of this stuff is just going into shred. As I'm working along, I got my earbud in and listening to you guys, to you guys scrapping. Oh, oh, yeah. I don't think I'll get rid of these. These are expensive. Plus, I want to try to build a new chicken barn this year. See if I can do that. So I'm going to keep those. Hey, look, I was looking for vice grips the other day. Lots of things. If you watch Scrap and Scorpion's uh, last video, he's going through boxes of stuff that he had when he first started. And I, and I was like the same way. I didn't know what to do with it. Didn't know what, how to clean it or anything. So, but now I'm getting to the point where it's like, oh, okay, I know what to do with those. I know what to do with that. Some cast aluminum. 
some nice wire and all kinds of stuff strip apart in that box and then get rid of the box so I'm hoping to take that table and swing it around so it's this way and move it in closer to here so I have more room out there yeah just little things I'm gonna get through there there's some I don't know if they're brass hinges or not but go through there and go through that stuff fan motor or something or vacuum motor yeah I'm almost on the verge of being a hoarder so anyway when I come to something neat or I want to show you guys I'll bring you back in and show you and I got a bunch of stuff there that I've got to fix up and or scrap out and I would like to uh, try to sell some of this stuff. I don't know if I can get a dollar or two a piece out of it on the online auction, like a box lot for five bucks. Put a bunch of these rake heads in and I think I've got sledgehammer heads and all those cool things yeah just see boxes with just little things in there and gonna go through all these things uh -oh. more tools <laughs> like I said just like Christmas time and I gotta get a box of those together because they all got transformers in them. Yeah, some of these boxes I have totally forgot what's in them, so it'll be a surprise for you and I both. Pale. Wannabe scrapper. I got some of my tools of the trade going here. Got lots of pails. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, and I've got to show you guys what I've got. I went to an estate auction and or estate sale and went to online a local online auction because I was getting inspired by nice junk and wannabe scrapper going to auctions. Never got a whole lot, but I got a little something, something. So I'll have to do a video up on that. Yeah. So just let us let me know what you guys are doing, what you guys are up to, how you put your days in. I'm trying to get my days filled with out here and little by little as as I have energy too. So <clears throat> I don't think I said a whole lot to anybody, but I'm off work right now and and trying to get through doctor's appointments and different things just to figure things out uh, I know some of you guys would just probably throw this right into your scrap but
That little motor should be good to go. Copper bearing right there. Little board here. I don't know if there's two screws. Or, um, I don't know if that's worth taking off or not. I just threw it in my shred bucket. Same way with this one. I think I already got no. It's, the little motor's still there, so. <laughs> Trying to do up interesting videos, but sometimes I wonder if it's just boring, same old, same old. Be able to make up some newer ones once the snow goes. My goodness. Every time you turn around, we're getting a couple inches here, a couple inches there still. So, anyway, I'll just call this one and say thanks for watching. Um, just a little update of what's going on here in the garage. Um, so, like, subscribe, share. Now that I got the community page, I'm trying to share you guys' videos more. And anyway, hope everybody has a great weekend. And uh, we will talk to you later once I get some more scrap and junk. Thanks a lot, guys.